What Justice Binta Inyako told me about this Mazinamdekanu's case, this is coming from Sam Amade. Sam Amade is the director of the Abuja School of Social and Political Thought. Sam Amade on Tuesday said that the charges against the incarcerated leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Namdekanu, do not make much sense legally. The statement comes after Justice Binta Inyako said she was going to rescue herself from Kano's trial. Amade stated that Justice Binta Inyako had said something close to, to that to him two years ago, but it will be difficult to prove the charges against Kano. The charges against Kano, Namdi Kano, do not make much sense, legally speaking, and in my opinion, difficult to prove. Justice Binta Inyako said something close to that to me two years ago. Not surprised she backed down. It is a political trial in the guise of a legal trial. End it. He posted on his ex on Tuesday. So, guys, you can now understand uh, the reason why Justice Inyako was like, wow, Nandi Kano have done me a very good, a very good, a very good to me. You understand? All this why she has been looking for a way to opt out from this case. As you can see, the Nigerian government just wants to punish Mazin Namdekano. They know. They have no case. They have no case against him. You understand? They know they have no case against him. And those of them who really know what they are doing, who do not want to partake in this, is a political trial. That is it. It's a political trial. How can someone say... Someone who has been discharged by your own court. You say this person committed crime against the Nigerian government. The same Nigerian court is now telling you, no, leave him alone. You have no case with him. You understand? The same Nigerian court asks you to pay this man compensation. You say, no, you not agree. You go follow him. So you see, when Igbo people are saying they are being marginalized, some persons go just begin to talk as if they don't know what they are saying. The question is, why is Mazin Namdekanu's case different? Some persons are reacting negatively, you know, the way he reacted on Tuesday in the court. The man is he just like a frustrated person. Just, you know the truth. You are not doing the right thing. What exactly is going on? Are we okay? That is the reason why he reacted the way he reacted. High court, I've told you no. This guy did not jump, jump, jump bail. These are one of the charges against him. How can someone open eye like this? If they carry two fingers, they come. You won't put your fingers for the person's eye. Make you blind the eye. Then the person is saying a burst. Make you open the eye, make you put them. So they actually wanted to buy the guy. So their, their anger was, why did you leave? He did not just leave because these people came. They did not see him. Okay, that one is a different case. This issue we are talking about, the invasion of Nigerian government to his house in that 2027 took the lives of 28 persons that very deadly night. And that was what led to the, the parents' death. You know, the kind age people now, they can't, they can't see the kind of a thing they're not supposed to see at that their age. That was what led to their early grave at that time you get because that is i can call it early grave they were not prepared god i'm not sure say god don't say their time to go but it, it's because of what they saw it was terrible it was horror now the question is why did the nigerian government invaded this house when you know say the case is already in the courts after you have done that you did not succeed you now came back and say why did he not stay so that you go finish him oh he jumped bail now court don't say in no jump bill. International organizations, human rights, international human rights, they don't tell Nigerian government everything about this Mazen and the Kano. But they have just refused. Binta Inyako know that the case will indict her later, later in life, her children. So it was a brave thing she did. You understand? It was a brave step she took. Just like as in the current say, rescue yourself from this matter because I not get confidence in you with the way I'm looking at you. She done the, you know, 
they 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 knock her head side by side. She's she she in fact she no even know the one when she did. It was just like a miracle for her to live. Don't also forget that this judge is the third person that have withdrawn from Nandi Kanum's trial. She is the third person. People who get integrity still there. Nigerian government should wake up. You understand? The younger ones, they are watching us. They are seeing what we are doing. This is no longer a country. I'm not trying to talk down on, on our country, but the way we are acting, it be like even in animal kingdom, they get rules and regulations. When you enter somebody's territory like that, unprovoked, you go collect. Uh -huh. So before somebody go attack you, you go get the reason why. But here, yeah, things are just done anyhow. I don't really understand. So Imade, some Imade have just said it. This is a political trial. Now the question is, what is the Southeast leaders doing? Because all of them, they are aware, they know. What are their roles in this issue? So very unfortunate. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly drop your comments below the comment section, please. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you and bye for now.